if there is one place on earth I think that is incredibly inspiring for musicians, it still is Vienna. My personal relationship to Beethoven is that I'm forever trying to make people understand that he is truly the greatest genius in any form of music. Just the opening to the fifth, the da-da-da-da, those few notes, every kid can walk past the piano and go da-da-da-da. It takes genius to realize that you can make a fireworks of a symphony out of it, that those few notes can mean so much. How deeply this music still touches us. I hate him for the middle movement of the sevenths because it's so brilliant in its simplicity. But that turnaround is so mm, amazing. Um, I know I'm supposed to mention the ninth, but I'm just not going to mention the ninth as being an absolute masterpiece. I come from film music, or I've come from pop music, really. And you're talking about trying to find the perfect hook. You know, Beethoven always knew that. He always knew you had to have a hook. I mean, middle movement of the Seventh Symphony, he can't do any better. The passion that is in that music, the constant giving his life to this music, Thank God that Vienna, at the end of the day, let him stay and gave him a home. Thank God he existed. Thank God he created. Thank God his music is there for us on a daily basis. Vienna sounds to me like music, but music that can be dissonant, music that can be passionate, music that can be romantic, music that can be beautiful, music that can be light, music that can be disturbing, music that can start a revolution, music that makes you dance, music that makes you want to live forever. How can you not love Vienna? How can you not, um, as a musician, first of all, just be in awe, walking down the streets and every street corner means something to you. It managed to embrace a forward-thinking, revolutionary Weltanschauung and at the same time maintain, you know, the beauty and, and um, the culture and everything from the past. Vienna is probably the last place on earth where musicians are properly respected. You just think about the thinkers and poets and philosophers and writers and the musicians and filmmakers. I mean, in my world, you know, where, where would we be without Billy Wilder? And I'm not sure about Ernst Lewis if he was Viennese or not. I mean, there would be no Hollywood without Vienna. It's an extraordinary place. The way the architecture of these beautiful buildings in Vienna influences the acoustics and the acoustic, on the other hand, then it influences the performance, which influences the music you want to write for the place, it has become timeless because a lot of us got to music. It wasn't by being in Vienna and hearing it as live music, but hearing a recording. And so many of these recordings were done at Abbey Road or any of the other studios that were really just copies of the architecture of a Viennese concert hall. When the Synchron stage got renovated, we might have been one of the first people to actually um, do something there. We recorded uh, Inferno with Ron Howard. Of course, we did a lot of episodes of The Crown with Peter Morgan. And it was very important for me that it would be Viennese musicians with Viennese technicians in a Viennese space. I don't know if it's um, Hollywood's pomposity that suddenly you know wants to bring in their own engineer or something like this. Or if it's the insecurity of the new place that says, oh, no, 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 we'll bring an engineer from, you know, Hollywood. Um, for me, it was very important that it would be the team from Vienna, because how can we start having an international conversation if we don't train our people to speak internationally? I love Vienna because of the friendliness of the people, of, of how I get received in Vienna. I love Vienna because I love the food. I love Vienna because I love going and seeing Egon Schieles. I love Vienna because I love hearing music in a sophisticated environment. If you're a composer and you have your music performed in Vienna by the Viennese, it doesn't get any better than that.